All right, man. Keith Murray says, uh, Shook, um, slap P. Diddy. I never heard this this story, but uh, let's take a listen to the audio uh, for educational purposes, for use purposes only. So here we go. I know, I know what part you going to be mad about me saying it because he knows and I know it happened. This is not true. I see Shook like, oh, he brought it from left field down south of Georgia on Buffy Life. Yo. Fire! Whoa! I was like, holy sh. Because, yo, now, I ain't trying to set Puffy up like no punk. Show me. Ah, no, I was like, oh, crap, a <laughs> I kid you not. I kid you not, yo. I kid you not. <laughs> I know, I know Puffy. And Puffy ain't gonna be mad about me saying it because he know and I know it happened. This is my truth. I seen Sugar like Hawk. He brought it from left. Phil down south of Georgia on Buffy like yo fire whoa I was like holy because yo now I ain't trying to set Puffy up like no punk show me Ah, no, I was like, oh, crap, I'm moly. <laughs> I kid you not. I kid you not, yo. I kid you. And I can believe, I can believe that, bro. You know, shout out to the Art of Dialogue. I got subscribed to them on YouTube. I could, I could believe that. I could believe that. I'm not saying it happened. So all allegedly. But I can believe that, bro. And you know, at the end of the day, um, <laughs> I can believe that, dog. And Suge was on that type of time. People forget Puffy was doing some gangster stuff too. But Puffy just knew how to smile and play the camera. And Puffy knew when to turn it on and turn it off. You hear about the story of the strength and conditioning coach at his son' college. Um, yeah, you hear about a number of things with with with, with Puffy, um, the whole shine thing. He knew how to turn it on, and he knew how to turn it off, and that and that and that was the difference between, um, that was the difference between Puff. Sorry for my my many pants arguing over something, but that was the difference between Puff and Suge. That was the difference between Puff and Suge. That was the difference, and that's totally believable. I'm not saying I know any knowledge that it happened, but that's totally believable. Now, Keith Murray seemed to be on some type of substance. Um, I will say that I don't sure you know what's going on with him, but uh, they and their argument is hilarious. Hold on, yeah, but yeah, he seemed to be on some type of substance or whatever, but. Like I said before, it had boot, but they had him and Shug. That whole beef was sparked over. It was sparked over. Um, you know, a lot of people believe it was sparked over Puff Bodyguard and this issue with Big Meech or whatever. And you know, that's kind of what kind of sparked the uh, sparked a beef for real. You know, and you know, Shug and Big Meech kind of roll with each other, and you know, all that type of stuff. But but yeah, you know, they let the media put them together. They let the they let the media play to put them you know play them against each other, and the media got paid off the East Coast West Coast beef, and a lot of people passed because of that, bro. A lot of good men and good women passed over that, and, and the media made the media you know blew it up. They blew it up, but I can I could totally see that happening. Suge is a big dude, man. Puff ain't that big, bro. Puff ain't small, but Suge is a big dude, bro. Let's call it for what it is. Suge ain't no small dude, bro. You know? Let's see if, you know, P. Diddy sent some dudes, some goons to get at uh, Keith Murray for what he said. But, yeah, that's totally believable. Yeah, you know, Suge, you know, Puff 5'10", Suge like 6'6". Six, six.
We like 6'6". Or 6'2". 265. Dude play for the Rams for a second. You know, but he got his too. Remember my man's beat him up in the club years later. But shit happened, dude. But did he did he didn't dish out some ass whoopings too though out here? You know, you got niggas that said, well, you know, I ain't never lost a fight in the street. Nigga ain't never did me. But slapping somebody is the most disrespectful thing. That's very disrespectful. For him not even have for him not even to have uh Him not even had a, you know, the audacity to ball his fist up is, is like, dog, for somebody to slap you, that's, that's, that's damn near, you know, that's damn near, that's damn near, you know, I got to spit on you or do something. Slap you back just don't do justice. <laughs> you know, that, you know, you might need to draw, draw something at that point if you catch my drift. But I, I could believe it, bro. I don't know if it's true. I never heard that story before. I never heard Suge talk about it, but there's so many different interviews. Somebody going to dig up Suge talking about it. Mark my words. Somebody going to get Suge on the... Uh, somebody going to get Suge on the... Uh, on the phone call talking about it. Mark my words. Mark my word, somebody gonna get shook on the on the phone on the phone talking about it. Oh yeah, we was at the uh we was at the quickie mark. You know, Apu was behind the counter and I seen Diddy in there by itself. I said, look at this pop, look at this whole ass nigga right here by itself. I said, Diddy, come here, you know bodyguards nothing. <laughs> he said, take that, take that, take that. <laughs> so I cocked back. Walk a moly, walk a moly, <laughs> walk a flock of man, should walk a flock of wasn't out there. You know what I meant. <laughs> oh man, yeah, that shit crazy. Man, keep very talking about giving girls top. You know what I'm saying? This joint is crazy, dude. But yeah, he needs some help though. He needs some help for show. Sure. But man, that, that was hilarious. That is the best clip of 2023 so far. So um let me know what you girls and guys think, man. Thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, next subscribe button, it's the bell icon button, hit all notifications, free chance the notifications. We go live or drop the video. Financially you want to support the channel, cash up dollar sign CJ Good 313, Remo CJ Good 313, PayPal link in the description. Hit the link tree. You can find me on Twitter, uh, Facebook, Twitch, Spotify, Anchor, Cash App, Venmo, PayPal, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, the whole nine. Link tree, the first link in the description. Appreciate the love, support, everybody supporting the channel. Um, let me know what you girls and guys think in the comment section. One time for the one time. Shout out to Music Entertainment Playlist. Let me know what's in the comment section. Peace.